uh, the wildfires burning here in Southern California have added fuel to the debate on how to prevent them. At issue is the heavy, heavy growth of, of the chaparral and the mm -hmm. trees. Some of that stuff hasn't been cleared or hasn't burned in 40, 40 or so years. Right. And with us this morning, Dr. Reese Halter, a wildfire expert, also author and TV host. Good morning. Good morning. And Thanks you're, for being here. You're Thanks. here to kind of show us what's burning in the wildfires and what can be done to prevent them. But let's go ahead and, and start with this fact because this was interesting. California has the highest diversity in vegetation than any of the lower 48 states. That's surprising. Yeah, that. Dude, That's we're, surprising. we're rich here. Yes. <laughs> but what it does is it creates all this chaparral, which we have here. Let's run down the line, Doctor, and you can tell us what we have on the table. Yeah, the, the real problem here are the grasses, and these are introduced grasses, and they burn. Not native, meaning. N not native, and they burn. We're going to show you, too. Not only do they burn, but the fact is, after they burn, the Look soils how, oh my goodness. are exposed, and that's when we've got all this uh, that took no time at all problems to go up. after that's going to come. The so mudslides. The mudslides mud and all of that. That's look a real. That I mean, burns. look at it, and uh, that's just a fact wow. that we have to deal with. So, uh, what are we looking at here? This th next. This is uh, chemise, a very common plant. We're going to see. Uh, it, there's a lot of buildup. Let's if we burn some of the the, the twigs uh, the and twigs, branches, and stuff. they're going to catch a lot more than the green stuff. Uh, all over our ecosystems yeah. here. Some of these are actually really pungent and smelly. What is yeah, that? Yeah, this is sage. Really? This, this is, sage. is sage. There's white and black like sage. Like the sage we would cook with. Exactly right. right. Okay. Does and it have a lot of oil in it? It has a lot of oil, ah. and the deal is the oils are highly volatile and uh, a way of protecting the plant from uh, losing moisture yeah. because, you know, we live in a fire forest and, right. and moisture is the thing here. And, and we get so very, I mean, so little rain to yeah. keep any of this, yeah. you know, yeah. it doesn't have moisture whatsoever. Mm -hmm. And some of the, old, the, some of this undergrowth is really old in this area, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, 50, 60, 70 years old. We haven't had fire. And, uh, and so when fire comes in now, we have a real problem. And then higher up in the mountains, yeah. the real deal is uh, there where we haven't allowed fire, We've got white fir and we got incense cedar this. that are carpeting the forest floor. Now, when you say allowed fire, do you sort of feel that it is important for? The, I mean, Mother Nature does take care of itself every now and then. We yeah. know that these lightning strikes will happen and fires will happen right. naturally. Does that sort of clear out some of this? And does it? Yeah. I mean, does it help in a way? Yeah, it does help. It does help. But I mean, in in the lower areas, the, in the chaparral, the real concern are the grasses. Yeah. The other stuff can contend with fire when it happens. It's the trees uh, in the Angeles National Forest that are burning and yeah. that, uh, that have to have fire. Yeah. And if they don't, then the, the density of the underbrush uh, seeds in well, and doctor, the volatility is... What wicked. do you think are some of the ways that we can handle this? Keep it under control. You know, they do the controlled burns. People clear things away from their homes. Brush clearance. What yeah. do you think? Yeah, well, I, this is what we've got to do. It's not what I think. We're, for the first time in 15 years I've been covering fires. We here in California, we're seeing fires that have been driven not by the Santa Ana winds, yeah. but by drought and climate change. This is a glimpse of the future. So what we need to do is emulate Mother Nature. Governor Richardson in New Mexico brought tens of thousands of inmates on the land and they cleared millions of pinyon pine trees, save Santa Fe. Yeah. Governor Schwarzenegger has got to get prison inmates on the land and he's got to clear around our homes. Interesting. Now it's interesting because a lot of people in their own homes are putting more drought resistant and native plants yeah. on a smaller scale. Does that help? Absolutely. Plant succulents. Right. Plant I succulents. love eucalyptus. Do not oh, plant, don't plant eucalyptus. It. Really? Not okay. it belongs in Australia. We want to tell you that this is Dr. Reese Halter, wildfire expert, author and TV host. Uh, we thought this would just be sort of educational for all of us. I think we yeah, certainly have learned you. a lot. Thank you. Dr. Reese, thank you so okay, much. We really safe. appreciate it. Our live team coverage continues fire crews hoping for a break in the weather today. High humidity is expected. We'll have more coverage of the fires when we come back.